Good morning. Good morning, y'all. What's up? How y'all feeling? So, what time is it? Y'all, I'm just now putting my phone on the charger because y'all know how y'all get like the night before and you like i'm not putting my phone in the charger i'm just going to be it that's how i was i didn't care about no charger i was so tired so sorry y'all so yeah it's nine o'clock oh my gosh it's nine o'clock on the dot as y'all can tell by the title today is going to be like a little bit day in my life of entrepreneur just showing y'all um what I do when I have to ship orders, when I get orders in and stuff like that. So, um, whew, I'm up early, y'all. Um, so, I just logged on my computer to see how many orders I have to ship and um, stuff like that. So, I'm going to show y'all now. So, I have three new orders that I have to fulfill. Um, and then you can see right now where it says paid and it says unfulfilled right there. And, um, sorry, I'm trying to focus. Um, that's how I see what, um, orders I have on my website. I use Wix. Um, if those of you don't, don't know, I've always been with Wix. It's, it's been working for me. I don't know about anybody else. I know other people have like mixed feelings about Wix. As long as I've been having my business, I've been using Wix and I haven't had no problems as of yet. I know a lot of people um, rave about Shopify and I've been looking into Shopify. It's just like for right now, I don't think there's a reason for me to move from Wix to Shopify. I also have the Wix app on my phone and every time I get a new order, it comes to my phone. So I look, excuse me, I look on um, both of those apps on my computer and on my phone um so yeah i'm super excited i don't think i've introduced that i own my own business on my youtube yet but i do it's called ozzy beauty and you can find us on instagram at shop ozzy beauty i'm gonna put the name um on the screen and also we have a website um it's called shop ozzy beauty dot store and i sell a little bit of everything i started off in beauty and um i'm venturing over to health so health and beauty because i feel like those two both go hand in hand and um as of now what these orders are they are my cmos i sell cmos now so um yeah if those of you that don't know I'll, I'll explain it a little bit later what it is. So I'm up now. Um, I have to get everything together for my orders. Um, also, a little note for my fellow entrepreneurs. Um, this is just a tip I have. Because um, I know starting small, we always look on Instagram and stuff and see our competitors or see our friends or whatever the case may be and see how many orders they're getting or how they're doing business and stuff like that and in the beginning if anybody tell you that you're going to get 100 uh, well, 100 orders a day they that's a lie to you i mean in some cases some cases people do um do that but don't beat yourself up about numbers in the beginning um because i just feel like that's that of course you want you want to make sure that your um you know your your business is going in the right direction but if i get one order two order three orders four orders i'm super happy every time i get um an order that comes to my phone I'm, i get super excited just because i just look at myself and remember when i wasn't getting any orders so instead of looking at the next person um, obviously you want to look at your competition to see what you're doing wrong or what you're doing right and, and stuff like that but just try to outdo your old self I remember when I in the beginning I wasn't getting no orders and now like ever since I launched my new um, business venture I've been getting an order like every week and I set that goal for myself so just set many goals for yourself and um, I feel like that's the best way to to see progress and stay on track um, don't beat yourself up, like I said, about numbers in the beginning. But, however, 
yeah so that's a little bit what, what we're doing today um yeah so let me get ready for the day and then we'll head off to the post office can y'all see okay so these are my three um these are my three items that I'm going to send today. So this is, I have a roll of stickers I used to put on top of the jars. And I just peel them off like this. And I take it and make sure that I measure, I make sure that it's on correct. And then I make sure there's no bubbles because you don't want any bubbles in your stickers. And there you go. Can you see? That's my logo. I'm going to put who designed my logo and stuff because these are my brand colors. And yeah, so I'm going to do that for each jar. now has a um, sticker on it you want to make sure that your packaging is up to date I mean no you want to make sure that you have packaging because you want your um, business to you know just be look professional be professional and stuff and then I also give them this thank you card I put inside of the um, package that's going to be sent it just says thank you and it gives some of the benefits um, that the CMOS has. It also gives you what you can use with it, like what you um, can put the CMOS in and stuff like that. So I give the customer, each customer, a, a thank you card. All right, y'all. So I'm in the car. Um, I have my stuff here. We're about to go to the post office. I showed y'all in the house um what i usually do before i go and by the way i just i really want to say um thank you to everybody who supports me um i'm literally nothing without y'all so thank you so much um it means the world to me i told y'all even when i get like the little notification i get so happy just because uh people believe in me people believe in my brand my business and um yes i'm just super thankful super grateful and um if y'all want me to do more business videos just leave a comment below or let me know i'll definitely do it i don't know everything uh it's only like year two for me so but the stuff i do know i'll be happy to share because i feel like um we're nothing without sharing knowledge with with each other and i just feel like that's that helps everyone grow everyone prosper so um yeah if y'all want me to do more videos about business stuff um, i'll be more than happy to do that but it's so hot y'all um it's so hot so let's i'm about to turn this air on and i don't want it to be too loud where you can't hear me talk but we're about to um drive to the post office so when we get to the post office i'll bring my camera back out okay okay y'all i'm at the post office We gotta wear a mask inside the post office. And I forgot mine was at home, so I'm so glad I had this in my purse. y'all that um 
not everything is all fine and dandy when you're dealing with the entrepreneur okay the biz the entrepreneur life is crazy i want y'all to see that's money right there on the ground that hurts my heart right there because i had a whole jar to drop while i was getting out the car so i have to run home real quick make another make another jar and then come back and send it but once you leave the post office, and once you get this receipt, um, I'm gonna show y'all when I get home how I put it in the computer and then what happens after that. So, I do have to go home and come back all the way to the post office to um, send a package because I want all my packages to be shipped out by today so they can get them by the weekend or, um, yeah. So, let's go home and do that and I'll be back. Okay, y'all, so. I'm back home and I have the receipts I got from the post office with the customer's tracking number. So I'm gonna show y'all, sorry, I'm gonna show y'all, let me log on to my computer. So I'm gonna show y'all what I do when I put in their tracking number. You see it has the item that they bought right here and then we're going to go to since I already went to the post office and I um, already wrote down the shipping label I'm just going to um, type in their tracking number. Okay once I typed in the tracking number right there um, I always you always make sure that this box is oh sorry you always make sure that this box is clicked because you want them to receive um, a shipping confirmation email. And my shipping confirma confirmation email is going to look like this. Um, this is this is nobody. This is not m one of my customers. This is just an example of what my customers will receive, and that's how their um, that's how the email is going to look. It's, it's very important to make sure that everything you use is branded because you want everything to look very professional um, and well put together. I just typed it in in my computer just for this video, but since I have the Wix app, I can do it straight from my phone on the app. Um, obviously, it's much more quicker and it's just easier to do and it's more convenient because you don't have to wait till you get all the way um to your house to enter the tracking number you can just do it right after you leave the um post office or wherever you you know drop your um packages off so um i don't want to show anybody's information where it says shipping carrier next to the tracking number you just pick which one um which carrier you use in this instance, I use USPS, so I'm just going to um, click that. So, yeah, I'm going to enter the rest of my customer's information, and then I'm going to come back to close out the video. So, I'll be back, y'all. <sighs> y'all, I'm so tired, but um, I finished putting all my tracking numbers in, and so now I am done for the day. I have to go to my nine to five job now i still work my nine to five job and i still run my own business and it's nothing wrong with that i want everybody to know um if you do both right now that is okay because that's what's going to fund your um your business um but i did get my llc so i am working towards you know leaving my nine to five but um i just know that people think it's like not a Sometimes people think they're not doing right because they see some stuff online and they see people just working in their business. But you have to have some funds to fund your business that you want to start or that you already started. So if that means working another um, a nine to five until you're able to quit, then do that. That's what I'm doing. It's not, and it's also nothing wrong with leaving a nine to five and going back because that's what I did too. Uh, people have bills. People have lives shit happens you know what i'm saying just in today like that's why i showed y'all when one of my jars broke like stuff like that happens in real life and it's either you're gonna quit or you gotta figure something out like 
I'm like, no, I need all my pack. I need all my packages shipped today. So that's what is, that's what we're gonna do. Even if I have to drive back home and drive all the way back to the post office, all my packages got shipped today. So stuff like that happens, and um, you just gotta move move with the punch you know what i'm saying and so i hope you all enjoyed this video um i don't think i've ever brought my business onto my channel but this is a start i'm just so over it's like my baby so i'm kind of like so overprotective over something that um i started so i kind of kept it away a little bit but um it's just time to put everything out there and so that's what i do um, that's a day in the life when I have to shit. This is a day in the life when I have to ship my packages. Um, and yeah, if y'all want more videos, like business like videos, like I said, I'll be more than happy to, um, put up more business videos. If y'all want to see stuff like that, if y'all have questions, I'm told y'all I'm like, I'm still learning myself, so I don't have all the answers, but I do have some answers and everything is also tri trial and error. Um, you're not going to know what to do unless you go through it and honestly that's what I did I've spent a lot of money messed up a lot of money just figuring stuff out and there's nothing wrong with that so um I hope you all learned something I hope this inspire you to if you don't have your business already start a business if you already do have a business keep going um don't let the numbers discourage you or get you down just keep fighting, set little goals for yourself, um, and be consistent. Consistency is key. I know that's so cliche, but it's so real. Um, people not gonna feel you unless you feel, unless you feel you. So they're not gonna take your business serious if you don't take it serious. So um, just stay consistent. Post if you don't post every day. Try to do once a week. Just little stuff like that, and do your research. Um, everything is online, Google, YouTube, all that is your best friend. Do your research, honey. But yeah, um, I'm going to leave my website in my bio. Um, if y'all want to support, shop, do anything, look around, feel free to do so. If y'all have any questions, comments, make sure you leave them below. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, and yes, thank you all for watching. See you in the next video.